What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. So basically I wasn't planning on filming today at all. Like I was just like wasn't planning on it. I like to normally like plan when I want to film and stuff but I just feel like I don't know. I don't know how I'm feeling. I'm in a really weird mood right now and I just wanted to film and I'm trying not to be too basic with my YouTube. I just feel like I don't want to be like everybody else, if that makes sense. Which I understand, like, there's so many thrifting videos out there, but that's something I'm actually passionate about. My shirt. <laughs> but, um, so basically I'm going to be talking about my college experience. This is something I have, like, I don't know. It's really hard to talk about it because I just... It was not good. I was always like, it never felt real that I was actually leaving like my family and going so far away. But I was so excited about it because I was like, I have to go away. I have to do the college experience. I have to be like everybody else and go meet new people freshman year and this and this and this. So, and all my friends were going away, like far away, like a good amount and so I was like I don't want to be the only one left back home and I was just like not in a good place last year at all like I was just doubting myself so much about where I wanted to go but I felt like God was calling me to this college so basically I'm gonna try not to make this too long but basically my parents had told me like we'll support you but we don't think it's a good idea we think you should save some money go to just like a community college because at that time I really didn't know exactly what I wanted to do yet just like I just didn't know exactly what I wanted to go into and I didn't have like a specific plan and so my parents were like like we think you should save some money and just go to a community college get gen eds out of the way um, stay home, save money. And I was like, I know that's probably a better idea, but I don't want to be the only one stuck back in my hometown. So I decided to go away to college. So I went to the school, made the drive with my parents, loaded up my car. So move-in day was very stressful. Um, I didn't wasn't very informed just because I'm so far away I it's not like I could just drive to the college whenever like an event went on or something for the incoming freshman or whatever so I was super out of the loop and I just felt very like stressed out and I was just like oh it'll work out like it, it'll be fine you know I was super go with the flow and I just it was very stressful and so basically it was move-in day and I moved in and I had three other roommates they were the sweetest people ever like they were so nice but they were f seniors being a freshman and then having seniors you know like there's an age gap and like not that that mattered or anything like but you know it's just kind of cool to experience like stuff with other freshmen because you're both in the same boat you're both like first coming in and all that um but they were so nice and like our room was so nice and like I had like a brand new dorm and all this stuff and I was like wow this is like all working out like I have nice roommates because you hear horror stories about roommates and all that stuff so I moved everything in on Friday and then I slept there that night I went to bed I had went to like this pep rally thing and it was really fun I woke up the next morning and I literally had this gut feeling in my stomach I can't even explain it it was crazy and it was just kind of like, why are you here? Like, what are you doing here? Like, I just kind of woke up with, I felt like no purpose. Like, I was just kind of like, what am I doing here? And that whole day was probably one of the worst days of my life. Let me be honest. So I was just super like, I am normally such an outgoing person. Like, you will, like, I'm crazy, I'm outgoing, like, I'm all this stuff. And I was nothing like that when I came to college so that's like my first thing is be yourself when you go to college because I wasn't and I just honestly felt like everybody already had friends like I would walk around campus like that night before I walked around campus with my parents because they're still there 
and like everybody had friends like everybody like all these girls were in a group walking together and these boys and these girls were in a group and I was just like how does everybody have friends like what is going on I know that's not actually how it was but that's how I felt and I was just like I don't understand how everybody is already making friends like I just got here like what is going on basically that whole day I didn't leave my room I didn't eat anything because I didn't leave my room and I just felt like I wasn't supposed to be where I was and that this was only the second day and I texted my parents that afternoon and I said I think I made the wrong decision like another thing is like don't always rely on social media social media is not real that's what I'm trying to say basically what people post on social media is only the highlight of their day it's only two minutes out of their 24-hour day and so all these photos I was seeing on Instagram about oh move-in day like so excited you know freshmen new friends and all this stuff and I had this assumption like preconceived notion that like this is what college was going to look like for me and it didn't and I was in a really bad place and I was just like I was like why like I was honestly like kind of frustrated I was just like god why would I go all the way out here and it not work out and I was so beside myself because I didn't even know how to feel I was I was in a really like lost place I'd say at this point because just not willing to um pay all this money and then not really know what I was doing there just wanted to like make this video to show you that not everything works out sometimes you know like if you don't know where you want to go to college or you don't know if you want to go away or community college is dumb like I just want to say like I get it I'm so confused because I was like nothing good is gonna come out of this and literally it's crazy how it was God's plan like all along for this to happen like it just the way it happened like it stinks that I had to go 18 hours and like live two days in college hating it to realize it if God never had me go out there then I would have been second-guessing myself all year being like oh I bet if I went to Florida it'd be awesome and I would have so many friends and all this stuff but then I realized like going out there I realized that this is where I want to be for the time being I just it wasn't God's timing for me to be out there your life if you don't know what you want to do like save money that's all I have to say knowing that I have all my like a good amount of money in my bank account still because like community college is so much cheaper and scholarships and I also just want to say it's okay to go to community college like maybe it's not the most awesome place to go but in the end everybody's getting the same gen eds done everybody's getting the same you're just paying a lot less money for it the things that God has blessed me with since like going away and coming back like I'm now the like kids worship leader person for our kids ministry and I absolutely love doing that and I love building relationships with the kids and also like I've gotten so much closer with my brother because of that because he's constantly at the church and just seeing the good things that have come out of it when I thought I was so lost and I just didn't even think anything good could come out of such a bad experience but to see how I've come out of that and I've grown from that and just how I'm going to be ready whenever I go away the next time. And I'm just so blessed that God like, did that for me and showed me that like it's okay to get lost but find him in it. You know like lean on God for your strength. Don't like try to do it all on your own because we won't get anywhere. I just wanted to make this quick little video just to say like if you're going to college or if you're gonna be going to college like it's okay to go away like it's some people it's what they want to do and it works for them like go you but others like if you don't know and you don't think you want to go to community college just because it's not the cool thing to do like don't base it off of that base it off of like maybe where you stand financially or maybe what you want to do like if you don't really know like me I didn't really know exactly what I wanted to do and so that's why like community college was just better for me because I could just get gen eds done and, but I'm just saying like 
it's okay to stay home. It's okay to not get like the college experience because I'm telling you, people hype it up so much more than it is. Like, yeah, I just wanted to make this little video just to encourage you guys that whenever you're going to college or if you're out of college or whatever, um, just do you and just do what God wants for your life. I love you guys so much. Make sure and subscribe to my channel and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys. Hey, feeling good, like I should.